Let's do the Lewis structure for water. In order to do the Lewis structure, the first thing we do is to calculate the valence electron. So we get two valence electrons from the two hydrogens and six valence electrons from oxygen. And they're giving me a total valence electron of six. You know uh, how to calculate the valence electron. It is basically the group number. After that, we do step two and decide on the central atom. And in this case, the central atom is oxygen. And uh, hydrogen can never be the central atom. So after we get the central atom, we draw the skeleton of the molecule as shown. With the oxygen, uh, two hydrogens attached with two single bonds. Then now let's calculate the lone pairs which are left after we allot the electrons for the hydrogens. The bonds take up two electrons each. Therefore, four electrons are gone, giving me four lone electrons or two lone pairs as shown in the water molecule there. I have two bonds and two lone pairs on the water molecule. So the next step will be to calculate the formal charge. The formula by which we use uh, to cal formula we use to calculate the formal charges: valence electron minus lone electron minus bond. For oxygen, we have six valence electrons, four lone electrons, two bonds. Therefore, it is zero. And the formal charge on hydrogen is zero because it has no lone pair and it has just one. They are bonds. After that, let's calculate the hybridization of the central atom. We have two bond groups, one hydrogen, the other hydrogen. And then we have two lone pairs, which is denoted by number three and number four in the figure. So two lone pairs, so totally giving me four. And therefore, this is the AB4 type molecule. And the hybridization of the central atom is therefore sp3. So we will predict the geometry of the molecule. Uh, sp3 hybridized molecule has an electron domain geometry of tetrahedral and the molecular geometry or we call it as the shape is bent. So the electron domain geometry is tetrahedral and the molecular domain geometry is bent for the water molecule. So now let us sum up. We get the Lewis structure of water as shown with two lone pairs with the hybridization of the central atom as sp3. The electron domain geometry is tetrahedral and the molecular geometry is bent. We call the molecular geometry sometimes as shape also and therefore water will not have a per perfect tetrahedral shape and hence the bond angle will be less than the tetrahedral bond angle.